Hi, Hestebrin. Hello, Sarah Quinn. <laughs> um, your partners in crime did not tell you that we were shooting an episode, did they? What else is new? So that's rude because you're the star. They want to keep you off the show. Yeah, they're trying to hate on me, and I don't appreciate it. <laughs> For reals. Um, <laughs> we have a lot of things in common, you and I, which is why I'm doing this interview. We do. We have a lot of things in common. We both love to read. Book club. Book We've club. Tell them about book club on this tour. Book club, uh, Sarah, myself, and Emily, um, who many of you know from such fan sites as sarahandtegan.com.ca, the others, Emily. We have a book club where we discuss things like books, like um, our lives, our relationships, uh, sexuality. And, um, you know, just positive political action movements, all kinds of things. It's very do, exciting. Do you want to know why we asked you into our book club? Yeah. It was sort of an affirmative action thing because it was two gays and so we needed a straight. <laughs> really? Then why'd you ask me? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. And not only do we have that in common, but we also have a very, very good TV show called The Wire in common. Oh, my God. The Wire is amazing. Well, you just finished season three or you're just finishing now? Oh, indeed. Well, you finished season three and today is my birthday and we're here in Hamsterdam. So it's exciting, but we can't we can't talk about it too much because Tegan, who's shooting this right now, is only what are you on season two? Mm -hmm. Tegan's on season two, so I don't want to ruin it. The last day of the tour, you know what I mean? It's true. But yeah. it's a great show. Happy birthday! Thank you. Sir. You've just turned twenty five. Do you feel like it's scary to be halfway to thirty? You know, I I feel so old on the one hand, and then in my heart, I just I feel so young. You know, and there's just still so much left to do. And uh, Hillary Clinton isn't even president yet, so that's just going to be amazing. And uh, you know, there's a lot lot happening. That's something else we have in common. We both think that Hillary Clinton is the next president already. Yeah, I think Hillary Clinton has been the next president for about um, you know twenty five years, twenty years, so twenty five years. Most deaf. Um, okay, so we, we can't drag this out too long because we're only allowed to have four minutes. Okay. But you have something that you passionately wanted to talk to me about. So let's do it. You know, this is something that's very close to my heart and something I've, I feel has gone um, unexplored. And I think it's important that we address it. And I just want to say, first of all, I thank you very much for the opportunity to do so. Um, this is really going out to the Tegan and Sarah community and to the fans at large. Uh, there's a website that I mentioned earlier called sarahandtegan.ca. It's a, it's a blogging site, a fan site, if you will. It's incredible. I've read a, m a bunch of amazing things about um, Emily, who we talked about, obviously, about t uh, Tegan and Sarah. Lindsay's on it. Emmy's on it. All the boys are on it, you know. But um, someone who's not on it, or uh, three people who aren't on it, are uh, myself, Spiro and Sprout, Northern State. And I just feel like how much more do we have to give to the Tegan and Sarah audience before you start talking about us on the website? L allow me to tell you some of the things we've given. Okay. We toured with you in Canada for four weeks. We toured with you in the United States for six weeks. We nearly died on that tour, not once but twice. We shared a bus with you in Europe. We've been in countries not limited to, but including uh, Ireland, Scotland, England, Germany, France, Holland, uh, Sweden. Where, where, where I, hear, I hear your passionate, you know, I hear your pa the passion in your voice about this. Please, people, please put on the lovers of the others, can you please put Northern State, at least as a bare minimum, can you put up Hesta Print? I mean, I just feel like there's so many issues to talk about. There's so much to discuss, and it's just so, so much unexplored territory, and I think people need to start, you know, just chiming in. I will, I will definitely, um, I will write you a letter of reference to .ca as soon as we get off of this, uh, of, of this uh, video. Okay, well, Tegan is telling me to wrap it up. Okay. I think it's because she started putting the camera really high up and her arms are shaking. <laughs> uh, we're just starting, she's, soon she's going to be shooting from below. Um, oh my goodness, Johnny for the third time today has now walked in on us again. Um, Anyways, we, uh, we are wrapping this up, and um, we, we do thank you, though, from the bottom of our hearts. Maybe .ca doesn't get it, right. but we get it. We've already done a, we did a group hug. Right. Which, I, which I've, heard, I've heard about the hug. I've heard about the hug. Okay, okay, Jesus. Anyways, we, um, we are going to continue book club. Okay, yeah. Um, we're going to have a party when Hillary Clinton becomes president. Oh, huge, huge. That's going to be huge. Yes. And I will be the first person to blog about you on Lovers of the Others when you, when you get up. Thank you. Thank you, Sarah. And, th and thank you, Tegan, and, and everybody. Thank okay. you. Thank bye -bye. you. Bye.